This is University of Manchester. The university has been complicit in the genocide in multiple ways. It's completely unacceptable for the university to be working with any aspects of the arms trade and supporting imperialism and war overseas. We've had three occupations. The university haven't responded to any of them. We've escalated our solidarity with the American students and the movement building up wider. Our demands are to cut ties with BAA Systems, which supplies fighter jets to Israel, to end ties with Hebrew University of Jerusalem, which is built on illegally occupied land. We also demand to cut ties with Tel Aviv University, which have created policy to target civilian infrastructure over military infrastructure. We would also like the university to adopt an ethical research policy and end ties with the arms trade. And our final demand is for no disciplinary action for students. We've decided on a decentralised power structure. All students have a collective equal vote. There's about 10 to 15 groups involved, but to be honest, most people coming up part of any group. Manchester Leftist Action has been big. They're a coalition of leftist students involved in direct action around campus. Very decentralised organisation. There's also been Youth Demand, an offshoot from Just Stop Oil. The Youth Front for Palestine have been heavily involved as well. There's definitely such a sense of community, bonds of comradeship being formed all around the camp. Students, staff, non-students alike. The UCU have also been very supportive. There are Jewish students involved, Muslim students involved, everyone's treating each other with respect and there will be a zero tolerance for any sort of religious or racial hatred. Organisations here have also been involved in rent strikes in previous years. There have been several unhoused people here who've been able to be provided food as well. We've also engaged in action. We'd like to see the expansion of the camp. Donations have been very useful. Books have been useful. A lot of people seem to be reading and just people volunteering to help out with the camp whenever they can. What is there to say? It's abhorrent what's going on. We express full solidarity with you and we wish you luck with dealing with the Israeli military.